Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Handmade by April. I'm April, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to create this super cute crop turtleneck top. But make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video to find out how you can win this adult, medium, slash large, or the toddler size, which is the finished project. materials that you're going to need for this project are a 5mm hook, a needle, a pair of scissors, something to measure with, and your yarn. I'm using a bulky wool blend. To begin, you are going to make a slip knot. And then you are going to make a chain that is big enough to cover from one side of your body to the other side. Once you get it to however long you want it, you are going to chain an extra three chains. To make this stitch, you're going to insert your hook at the fourth chain from your hook and you are going to yarn over, pull through, and then yarn over, stick your hook back into the stitch, yarn over, pull through, and then you're going to yarn over and pull through all of the stitches and then you're going to chain one, skip a stitch, and do make another stitch like the first one. You're going to continue that all the way across until you reach the end. To start the next row you are going to chain three and then continue making your stitches all the way across. You're going to put your stitches into the little triangle right here, not in the chain one area. So you're just going to insert your hook, yarn over, pull through, and then yarn over again. Insert your hook, yarn over, pull through, and then yarn over and pull through all of them chain one, skip the chain one, and then continue with the stitch into the next triangle. You're going to continue doing this until your project is as long as you want it, up to the bottom of the chest. I wanted my top more cropped, so after you get it to however long you want it, you are going to start decreasing. So you are going to crochet down the row, leaving the last two stitches, and I will show you where to go from there. To start decreasing, you are going to insert your hook, yarn over and pull through, and then yarn over, insert your hook into the last stitch, yarn over, pull through all of the loops on your hook. Then you are going to chain three, turn your work, and then you are going to crochet down your project and then decrease again at the last two stitches. You're going to continue decreasing until you get up to your, just past your collarbone. Mm -hmm. 
after you have two of those panels made you are going to start working on the neck and to do that you are going to make a chain on each side so that it is big enough to fit over the head but it's not too big around the neck for me that number was 10 on each side so you're just gonna make that chain and then you're gonna half double crochet it onto the other panel and just half double crochet across the back panel then you're gonna make your other chain of 10 then half double crochet on the front panel And then you are going to slip stitch into your first stitch and you are going to continue making half double crochet rows until your neck is as thick as you want it to be. I made mine to be four rows and then you are just going to cut and tie off your yarn. And then you are going to fold your work inside out and you are going to sew together the rows that you did not decrease on. So for me I'm sewing together four rows and then that will finish your project. Okay so to enter to win you must be subscribed to my channel and you must comment in the comment section below which top you would like to win either the toddler size or the adult size and the winner will be announced on October 4th so good luck and thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and I will see you in my next video.